Hey guys, what's going on? It's Greggles TV. I'm going to show you how to install the Google Play Store and Google Services on the $50 Amazon Fire tablet. I've already done a video for both of those in separate videos, but now I'm going to combine them. And you don't need a PC just like you didn't in the other one. And it's super easy. You can have everything done in about five minutes probably. So let's get to it. First thing you want to do is swipe down from the top, go into settings. Go down to security, apps from unknown sources, turn that on, hit OK, hit the home button, and now you want to click on that link below in the description of this video. That's going to bring you to my website. Now you, what you want to do is where it says uh, click this link for step one to the right of that, just click that link. Now what you want to do is you want to download and install these in order. You'll see number one, two, three, and four. Start with the one, click on it, it's going to start downloading eventually. Hit OK at the bottom right, hit Open at the bottom, hit Next, hit Install, hit Done, click on the number 2, hit OK, hit Open, hit Next, hit Install, hit Done, hit number 3, hit OK, hit Open, Next, install. Hit done. Click the last one, which is four. OK. Open. Next, install. Hit done at the bottom. Now it's going to bring you back to that page with the four files. You want to hit your back button. It's going to hit the link next to step two. Now the first four files install the Google Play Store so you can download apps from the Google Play Store. These two files are going to set up uh, Google services for you so that if you download YouTube or any Google app, it's actually going to work. Also, Google Play Games will work as well. So what you want to do is tap on the first file you'll see right here. And again, it doesn't matter which these two files are downloaded and installed in order. So you don't have to worry about that. But we'll start with the first one to the left. I'm going to hit OK. Open install, hit done at the bottom, click on the second file, and the, which is also the last file, hit OK, hit open, install, hit done. Now Google Play Store and the Google services are now installed, but you don't want to open it yet. You need to restart the uh, tablet, so hold the power button at the top, hit OK, let it power off. Okay, now that it's off, what you want to do is power it right back on. All right, great. So the tablet is booted back up. Hit agree to the allow Google's location. I, you don't have to, but I'm going to hit agree. And then also previous version, and you turned off the ability for Google Apps to access your location. I'm going to hit yes to turn it back on. And that's all good and going. So what I'm going to do now, hit OK to expand storage. Now what I'm going to do is just open up the Google Play Store and it should ask me to sign in and it does so I'm going to sign in real quick and here you go here is the Google Play Store it's the older version but it will auto update for you it might take about 20 minutes just hit that hamburger menu at the top there and then click on settings and you can see the build version right here when you tap that it's going to say a new version of Google Play Store will be downloaded and installed so you can just hit OK and that will eventually happen um, behind the scenes. I'm going to try to close all my apps and see if it shows the newest version. Otherwise, I might just need to restart. And there you go. It's going to show the new Google Play Store. It gets started. Now that you have the new Google Play Store, what you want to do is tap the search button at the top there and type in Google Play Games because we want to update the Google services. So once you got that open, just install that and when we install it, it's going to ask us to... Alright, that's installing now. Alright, just hit open on that and when we open that, it's going to say Google Play Services is not up to date. So just hit update. There you go, update. Accept. It's going to download. 
Now that that is updated and installed, I'll show you that Google Play Games works and downloading apps works as well. So I'll type in Cooking Fever and install that. So I already had it installed. You can see Google Play Games is already asking if I want to sign into my account. My name popped up at the top there. So there you go guys, that's how you install Google Play Store and Google Services to get everything for that stuff to work. If you have any questions or comments, leave it down below. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys down the road.